Sadly, MS is a disabling disease that affects the young. I have spent 25 years alongside my colleagues trying to develop treatments to improve patients' lives. In MS, we have over 12 different disease-modifying therapies now available. And while these have proven effective for many patients, unfortunately many patients still go on to experience disease activity and accumulation of disability. There is gathering evidence that HSCT may be the most effective disease-modifying therapy available. The studies have shown up to two-thirds of patients have remained remain stable or even improved over a three-year period. HSCT should be considered in patients who have tried other DMTs without complete stability or even patients with aggressive disease that might benefit from a highly effective therapy such as HSCT. It has to be recognised that HSCT is an intense treatment and therefore patients have to be selected or those who benefit most from it and also be able to tolerate it. We have a set of guidelines to select those patients most appropriate. Those would be patients who obviously have a confirmed diagnosis of MS and if you're relapsed or remitting you have to fulfil the McDonnell criteria but in particular if you're primary progressive you also have a need to have a lumbar puncture with oligoclonal bands which shows a chronic inflammatory process. We'd also suggest that patients are probably suitable between the ages of 18 and 65 and also that the disease duration should be no more than 15 years as it's suggested that the earlier you treat with HSCT the greater benefit you have. Another important guideline is that patients should be ambulatory and that means walking freely on their own or with a stick but at least walking 20 meters with bilateral assistance such as crutches or two sticks. At London Bridge Hospital we like to consider each patient on a case-by-case -case basis and if we feel the patients are likely to benefit from this therapy we will present them to the London HSCT panel and this panel is there to identify those patients who are really going to benefit the most from this highly effective therapy. Personally my experience is that it's transformative and it can really change patients lives for the better.